dear friends my name is pooja bhandare assistant professor dada saheb balpande college of pharmacy desa nagpur so in previous lectures in previous videos we will discuss about and we will start about the pharmaceutical inorganic chemistry uh, b form first year first sem subject and we will discuss about introduction of inorganic chemistry and what is the history of inorganic chemistry and then monograph what is the what is meant by monograph then we will discuss about the indian pharmacopeia history of indian pharmacopeia and all details about that so in this video we will discuss about unit first part second types and sources of impurities ye bhi ek part matlab unit first ka hi hai but isme hamara jo part first tha usme humne inorganic chemistry ke bare mein dekha hai introduction aur history ke bare mein dekha hai इंडियन फार्माकोपिया के हिस्ट्री के बारे में देखा है देन इन पार्ट सेकेंड वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट टाइप्स एंड सोर्सेस ऑफ इम्प्यूरिटी सो लेट स्टार्ट द फर्स्टली वॉट इज मीन बाय इम्प्यूरिटीज वॉट इज मीन बाय प्योर वॉट इज मीन बाय इम्प्योर एंड वॉट इज मीन बाय इम्प्योर केमिकल कंपाउंड सो अ कंपाउंड इज सेट टू बी द इम्प्योर इफ इट इज हैविंग अ फॉरन मटेर मैटर्स फॉरन मैटर्स दैट इज इम्प्यूरिटीज then pure chemical compounds is opposite to the impure chemical compounds a pure chemical compounds refers to that the compound which is having no foreign matters chemically purity means freedom of foreign matters then analytically 100% pure substance are not available and traces of impurities must be present in all their chemical compounds 100% pure substance are not uh, available then normally undesirable foreign matter materials is present in this pharmaceutical substance so impurity means a compound is having impure that is having a foreign matters that is called as impurity impurity is a material that affect the purity of the materials of interest so impurity affect the purity of the substance presence of impurities in the pharmaceutical substance may produce toxic effect on the body and may also lower down the activity strength of the pharmaceutical substances impurities commonly in the chemical substance including small quantities of lead arsenic iron chloride and sulfate so the impurities affect the purity of this material and it will be the toxic in pharmaceutical substance is having a uh, lower down the activity strength of the pharmaceutical substance then it's commonly in chemical substance including the small amounts of lead arsenic iron chloride so we will check it the impurities of chemical substance so then types of impurities so firstly types of impurities are main classifications of impurities organic impurities inorganic impurities and residual impurities organic impurities starting materials by product se milti hai intermediate matlab agar hum koi uh, synthesis kar rahe synthesis ki process kar rahe to usme jo bhi hum starting material use karte hai to uske andar impurities ho sakti hai ya by product mein bhi impurities ho sakti hai jo synthesis mein hum intermediate wagera use karte hai usse impurity ho sakti hai uske andar impurity ho sakti hai degradation hota hai kisi product ka to uske impurity ke डिपेंड uh, में उसका डिग्रेडेशन uh, होता है रीएजेंट्स लिगेंट एंड कैटालिस्ट इस तरीके के जो होते हैं उसको हम ऑर्गेनिक इम्प्योरिटीज बोलते हैं देन इनऑर्गेनिक इम्प्योरिटीज रीएजेंट्स लिगेंट्स कैटालिस्ट हेवी मेटल्स डिस्ट्यूट्स मेटल इनऑर्गेनिक साल्ट अदर मटेरियल्स इस तरीके से इनऑर्गेनिक होती है इम्प्योरिटी इन दिस रिसिडर सोलन देर आर थ्री कैटेगरी क्लास फर्स्ट क्लास सेकेंड एंड क्लास थर्ड class first is the solvent to be avoided in this category the solvents are included in benzene carbon tetrachloride 12 dichloroethane 11 dichloroethane and 11 di trichloroethane then class second solvent to be limited in this category acetonitrile chlorobenzene cumin cyclohexane then third category is the solvents with low toxic potential in this are included acetic acid acetone ethanol pentane triethylamide then sources of impurities 
in pharmaceuticals there are different sources of impurities in the pharmaceuticals are listed below like 11 impurity sources then one by one we will discuss about that and i will say that the in this uh, this uh, point sources of impurities in pharmaceuticals are very important in the bpharm first year first sem for university exam uh, we will uh, in university exam we will for um, uh, 10 marks and 5 marks also so it is a important point in units first uh, impurities types of impurities and sources of the impurities in pharmaceutical and these sources are explained all sources are explained one by one the firstly first sources is the raw material used in the manufacturing then second in the reagent used in the manufacturing process third is the method process method or process used in the manufacturing or method of manufacturing then chemical process used in the manufacturing then fifth one is the atmospheric contamination during the manufacturing process sixth one is the intermediate product in the manufacturing process seventh is a defect in the manufacturing process manufacturing hazardous inadequate storage condition and decompositions of the product during the storage then accidental substitutions or deliberate adulterations with the superior or useless material there are the sources of impurities then we will explain one by one sources of impurities is a raw material employed in the manufacturing so all the manufacturing process we will use the raw materials and is raw materials having the impurities so it will be the affect your final product and your result final result so impurities known to be associated with these chemicals may be carried out through the manufacturing process and contaminating with the final products like examples rock salt rock salt rock salt contains amounts of calcium sulfate and magnesium chloride then the sodium chloride prepared from the source will be contain the calcium and magnesium compounds so impurities such as arsenic cleats and heavy metals are present in the raw materials and hence are found to be in the substances so it is necessary to use pure chemicals and substances as raw materials for manufacturing processes in this uh, we will use in this process raw materials like rock salt and rock salt contain impurities such as arsenic cleats heavy metals in this raw materials and is uh, it is very necessary to in this uh, process we will use the raw material in the pure form then like second example is a copper sulfate may be prepared by the action of sulfuric acids on copper things so copper and sulfuric acid it will be the form the copper sulfate theek okay. hai so copper turnings are known to have iron and arsenic impurities if the large quantity of this impurities are present in this raw materials the copper turning they may be enter in this final product so will be the final product copper sulfate are having the impurities like arsenic ions so due to this in this due to this uh, this indian pharmacopoeia prescribe the limit of tolerance for the arsenic as the impurities are not to be the more than 8 parts per million in the copper sulfate so similarly it is prescribed a limit of iron as a impurity so copper sulfate firstly copper sulfate prepared from the copper and uh, sulfuric acid sulfuric acids so in this have a copper have a uh, impurities like iron and arsenic and it will be the uh, goes to the final product like copper sulfate so indian pharmacopoeia prescribes the all limit of impurities present in this uh, product so it will be the uh, in uh, indian pharmacopoeia prescribe the limit of arsenic limit of uh, arsenic impurities is not more than 8 per million it will be the more than it will, this copper are not used for the copper sulfate so firstly we will check the limit of uh, firstly we will check in this copper the amount of arsenic present in this copper and then it will be the use for the <coughs> making the copper sulfate then next Uh, in sources, 
reagent used in the manufacturing process. If the reagent used in the manufacturing process are not completely removed by washing, this may find entry into the final products. Then, examples. Animated mercury may be the prepared by the adding solution of mercury chloride or dilute ammonium solution. Then the precipitate of ammoniated mercury final products contain the ammonia hydroxide, ammonium hydroxide. Thus this precipitate is washed with the cold water to remove the ammonium hydroxide. If it is not removed completely by washing with water, the final product may contain the ammonium hydroxide as the impurities. So, in this many manufacturing process, we will use the process like washing with water, washing with alcohol. Then, in this washing, washing are not uh, properly prepared. Then, this, uh, this product, this uh, contents are present in this uh, your final result. So, in these examples, firstly, the reagents are not properly washings are not removed by the washing are entry into the final product this is the examples for this sources and the next is the methods or the process used in the manufacturing many drugs and chemicals usually are the manufactured from the different raw materials by using the different methods or process some impurities are incorporated into the materials during the manufacturing process the type and amount of impurity present in the drugs, chemical varies. So it will be the, also the impurities are present in this process. In certain drugs, a multiple step of synthesis procedure is used in the product. Then the purification of intermediate is also the important. Otherwise the impurity present in the intermediate will be in, uh, incorporated into the final product. So purification intermediate is also the important procedure. Usually side reactions during the synthesis, the impurities of the product, side reactions also occur in the substances. This may be introduced new impurity due to the contamination of the reagents or solvent at the various stages in this process described below like reagents employed in this process, reagents added to remove the other impurities, solvent, action of solvent and reagent on the reaction spaces. So we will discuss about and we will explain about all this procedure. We will carry out on the next pro next slide and this next process. Like oh, firstly the reagent employed in the manufacturing process. What <clears throat> then reagent removed reagent added to remove the other impurities. Like give these examples and explain. Then solvent, कौन-से कौन-से solvent हम use करते हैं like tap water, tap water में किस type की impurities present होती हैं, then soften water, then demineralized water, then distilled water, distilled water is considered as the best but is very costly, then tap water हम हर एक process में tap water अगर use करेंगे तो इसके अंदर minerals present होते हैं and it will be the gives the impurities and it will be the goes into the final product. Then action of solvents and reagent reactions vessels जो हमारे solvents होते हैं हमारे जो भी हम vessels use करते हैं जो भी हम glass वे glass apparatus है कौन से भी apparatus वगैरह use करते हैं तो उसके vessels के साथ reactions करते हैं like the iron iron is a known contain of the arsenic impurities the inorganic compounds manufacturing in iron vessel will contain the arsenic and iron as the impurity so the Indian pharmacopoeia has prescribed the limit of arsenic and iron for the most in the inorganic compounds. Then fourth one is a chemical process used in the manufacture. For the synthesis of the drug, many chemicals reactions such as nitration, halogenation, oxidation, reduction, hydrolysis are involved. In this chemical process, different chemicals are used. Tap water generally used in this various process having calcium, magnesium, then ions which are generally found in the substance uh, is being manufactured and limit of this impurities have been prescribed in the large number of cases. Potassium iodide is manufactured from the iodine which is obtained from the kelp of seaweed cyanides tend to get formed in the nitrogenous organic matter is burned 
with the alkalis the limit tests have been prescribed for the cyanide in the potassium iodide so it will be the all the limit tests are prescribed in indian pharmacopeia then fifth one procedure is the atmospheric contamination during the manufacturing process in this industrial area the atmospheric is a contaminated the dust particles and some gases like hydrogen sulfide sulfur oxide and black smokes during the manufacturing or purification the pharmaceutical products product this impurities enters in the final product there are many pharmaceutical products which when manufactured are contaminated with the atmospheric co2 and water vapors like example naoh absorb atmospheric co2 then due to the reaction naoh should not kept open for a longer time during the manufacturing because because naoh absorbs co2 in this atmosphere so therefore Indian pharmacopoeia has prescribed that sodium hydroxide should not contain more than three percent of sodium carbonate. Then six one is the defect in the manufacturing process. In the many manufacturing process, there are defect like imperfect mixing, incomplete or uh, incompleteness, non-adherence to proper temperature, presence pressure or pressure, pH or reaction of condition, which may be give the chemical. compounds with impurities in them like example zinc oxide may be prepared by heating metallic zinc to bright redness like zinc oxide may be prepared by the it heating metallic zinc to bright redness in a current of air then the vapors of zinc burn to form the zinc oxide which is a collected to the fine white powder but if there is a less heat or air or both so zinc metal is not completed converted into the zinc oxide so this final product zinc oxide may be still contain metallic zinc as a impurity so ip prescribed as a test of zinc metal in a zinc oxides then then uh next is a intermediate product in the manufacturing process so there are the some intermediate which are produced during the manufacturing process sometimes this intermediate may be carried out to the final product such as impurities example potassium iodide is prepared by the reacting iodine with potassium hydroxide the resulting solution is first evaporated and then heated with charcoal in this process if there is a intermediate product then is not completely converted into the potassium iodide then it may be the carried out through the final product as an impurity then it is a manufacturing hazardous like particulate contamination these types of manufacturing hazardous process co error cross contamination microbial contamination packaging error first is a particulate contamination this presence of unwanted particulate matters can arise due to the dirt dust glass porcelain or plastic fragment from the sieves granulating or tableting machines or from the product containers so wear and tear equipment or improperly clean equipment may also cause the particular contaminations clearly the solutions for the injection in particular importance like examples metal particles which have been found in eye ointment packed in the metal tubes so it is a particular particular contamination this types of contamination then process error gross error arising from the incomplete solution of a solute in a liquid preparation must be detected readily in the normal analytical control procedure then minor error arises from the manufacturing tolerance for the quality uh, of active ingredient in the product have been wide has been wide 
then cross contamination the handling of the powder granules and tablet in large bulk then create air bar dust which leads to the cross contamination of this product so face mask and facial extraction equipment are used for the protect operate from the harmful effect of this drugs example penicillin preparation requires special handling during its manufacturing microbial contamination like parental preparations and ophthalmic preparations require special care against microbial contamination many liquid preparations or creams are liable to bacteria and fungal contamination so care should be taken example acacia senna tragacanth they should be controlled for the salmonella packaging error product of similar appearances such as tablet of same size shape color then packed in a similar container can constitutes of a potential sources of danger the improper labeling or distribution of stock of unused labels also constitutes of a major packaging hazards the ninth one is a storage condition the chemical substance when prepared have to be stored in a different types of containers depending upon natural nature of the material batch size quantity many types of materials are used for the storage purpose like plastic polythene iron vessel stainless and aluminium the reaction of this substance plus with material storage vessels the products are found as the impurity in the next one is a leaching out effect alcohol is stored in ordinary glass container extract lead from it so which is found to the impurities in the final products then stored chemicals react with the iron container and extract iron and impurities in this final product then it are in adequate storage and their effect as follows like when stored product may become contaminated with the dust bodies of insect animals and insect etc then chemical instability decomposition because of the light traces of acid or alkali air oxidation water vapor co2 and traces of the metallic ions example slight sensitive material should be stored in the umbered colored bottle reactions with the container materials example salicylic acid ointment must not be stored in the metal tubes then physical changes the occurrence of the changes in the physical form of drug like changes in the crystal size can lead to change in the efficiency of the product then temperature effect chemical and physical changes occur if materials are not stored at a proper temperature then decomposition of the product during the storage some substances decomposes on keeping the decomposition greater in the presence of light air or oxygen the result of decomposition bring about the contamination of the final product substances which contain water of the crystalline loss on being kept open while the deliquescent substances absorb water from the atmosphere and get liquefied so decomposition product appear as the impurities in the substance accidental substitutions or deliberate so adulteration with superior or useless materials it is possible to avoid accidental substitutions by storing the toxic substance together if the possible to avoid accidental substitution by storing the toxic substance together separately or in lock cupboard many pharmaceutical chemicals are adulterated with the cheaper substance example the expensive potassium may be adulterated with the sodium bromide then effect of the impurities the impurity present in the substance may be give the following effect like impurities having the toxic effect may be injurious to the health if present about certain limits traces of impurities may be exert accumulate toxic effect after a certain times impurity may be lower the active strength of the substance then impurity may be decrease the shelf life of the substance impurity may cause 
incompatibility of the other substance impurity may cause the physical and chemical changes in the property of the substance so making the substance medicinally useless may cause changes in color odor taste then test for purity pharmacopeia prescribe the test for purity for the pharmaceutical substances to check their freedom for the undesirable impurity pharmacopeia will decide the fixed limit of tolerance in this impurity for the certain common impurities for the pharmacopeia prescribe in the test and purity like color odor test physico chemical constant acidity alkalinity humidity of then cations anions insoluble constituents ash water insoluble ash arsenic or lead loss on drying loss on ignition then last is a then last is a thank you if you are like my video uh, please like it share it and sub subscribe it share it to your friends and subscribe and if you have the ppt on this uh, video or on this uh, syllabus so uh, we will uh, provide link in the description box and go it and check for it then next video uh, is a limit test it is very important and we will the upload it very soon thank you so much keep watching and keep liking thank you